Hey guys, it's your girl Shonda. How are you? And welcome to Shonda Says It's Fat Friday Fashion and Talk. Now, normally when I do Fat Fridays, I try to have music, but tonight I don't have music. And it feels very weird because now I'm used to the music. It kind of gets me in the vibe. So tonight's, um, excuse me, tonight's Fat Friday is going to be kind of quick because I've had a really, really, really busy week. If you hear my dog in the background, please don't pay him no mind. Somebody's probably at the door, but there's always stuff going on in my house. But anyway, tonight I went on a little shopping excursion at the local mall with my daughter. And I went into Forever 21 now. Forever 21, a lot of times I'll see people with a nice shirt or a dress or something. I'm like, oh, I love that. And they say, oh, I got it from Forever 21. Now, I've never went in there and really found much of anything that I liked a lot, a lot. I'll be honest with you. Not to say that I don't like it because online I've ordered some great stuff from Forever 21. It's just hard for me to walk in the store and find something that I really like or that I connect to. But tonight, I wanted to show you my little finds that I got there. For one, my earrings, Forever 21. And my little necklace here, Forever 21. I love that. But I have to share with you this other necklace I bought from them, which I just totally love. How cute is this? Isn't that nice? Imagine if these were real diamonds. Mm. Be too through with myself. But anyway, I thought that was cute. And I'm an accessories girl. I totally, totally love accessories. Again, I have real jewelry, but I have to say, I have more fun with my costume jewelry. I don't know. I'm I'm sure that I showed you guys these two that Rachel Fenimore made for me from Fenimore's jewelry. Now I have to show you the dress I found because I did find something I, I would like to wear from Forever 21. So let me show you this dress. Do my little magic tricks here. I have two dresses to share with you guys. I found this. It's like a sweater material. How pretty is this? And I have to tell you, <laughs> your girl looks good in this dress. Isn't that pretty? Look at the neckline. And it's really nice. It kind of has that Hervé Legere look, but I'm not spending that kind of money on that. Anyway, if it's beautiful, it looks great, and that's all that matters. And a great shoe, okay? But Forever 21, it was $27.99, so I love that. So that was there. Then I go to MAC because who goes to the mall don't go to MAC or Sephora? You know how it is. I went to MAC. But anyway, I have a quick question for you guys. I need a good pink eyeshadow. It's very, very hard for me to find pink, and I love pink, and for it to show up on my skin. And it's it's so weird, but this particular color I got, it's the, uh, what's the name of this? Guys, I'm so sorry. I don't know the name, but this is it. This pretty much showed well on my skin, so I'm going to try that out. I bought that, and I bought a Sheer Tone Shimmer Blush from there, and let me show you this one. It has a nice kind of bronzy look to it, and it's called Ambering Rose. Sound like Amber Rose to me. <laughs> Which, I like her. I would love to meet her. I just love her different look. She's so pretty. People give her flack, but I don't know. But Amber Rose, either you love her or you hate her. Girlfriend, Shonda loves you. Keep doing you. Let their haters hate. But anyway, that was there. And I went to H&M because who doesn't love H&M? I love H&M. And I found this necklace there. Isn't this pretty? They had uh, matching earrings which I bought, but I gave the earrings to my, my daughter because I don't like looking matchy-matchy with things. I like things to be kind of off. I don't know if it's the Gemini me. I just don't like things that are so cohesive. I like I like it to be something thrown in that you, you don't expect. So bought that there. And honorable mention for Fat Friday. As you know, I love Rachel Pally. Always talking about Rachel Pally. I wore a Rachel Pally gown to Full Figured Fashion Week, the finale, the black gown you see me in, I wore that. 
uh, Rachel Pally gown. And I, I bought another dress recently from Rachel Pally, which is, I have the long version in black, but they have a short version. And I got it in white because now I'm like so in love with white because now finally they're making white clothes for plus size women. Go figure. The light bulb has gone off. But I bought this dress. It's very simple. It's a kimono dress. Very simple but very sexy. The shoulder is out. And it's just so, it's simple and elegant. And I so love it. And thank you, Brooke Wilson at, at Rachel Pally. She always takes good care of me there. So I'm so appreciative of that. What else did I want to talk about? Oh, yeah. A long time back in my Fat Friday videos, one of the videos, I can't remember which one, I love to predict what's new and happening. Now, I predicted white. You would see a lot of white. And what do we see now? A lot of white. I'm also, I also predicted red. Well, don't you know, lo and behold, red is the it color. The it color of now and the fall season. As a matter of fact, I'm going on record that I'm going red with my hair in the fall. So, if this is a color that you shy away from, do not shy away from red. Reds and plums and purples, and as you see, there's, doing, there's a lot of color blocking in fashion. Go out there and buy you some red. Your girl just ordered a red suit. Yes, jacket with the pant, wide leg. I am too fierce. Can't wait to show you that. But red is the new black, is the new white. But for me, with fashion, whatever color you feel good and beautiful in, you should rock that color because that's what fashion is all about. But anyway, what else did I want to share with you? Oh, this little nail polish. I found this at Forever 21 too. It's a beautiful coral color. Kind of matches the eyeshadow that I bought. But I'm trying to get the name off this thing. Maybe it's inside. Just give me one quick second. You know your girl's all over the place. You know how I am. It's called Paradisco. Paradisco. So if you're watching my video and you have a good pink color that you think will show up on my skin, actually I prefer, I like shimmers, but I prefer matte colors for me. Really love matte colors. So if you have a pink out there you think will work on my skin tone, let me know. And, oh yeah, real quick accessory. Everyone, I know you guys watch Basketball Wives, okay? A lot of the earrings that they wear, people are clamoring for those looks. Like the big hoops with the crystal balls on them. Everyone loves what Evelyn and the girls are wearing. If you love that design, don't ask another jewelry designer to recreate that look. Designers don't like that. They like to be the person that creates their own and they like to offer it to you. But don't ask people to recreate something that's already being done. If you love those earrings, you could go on ilovepaparazzi.com. I will give you the link and you can order those earrings that you see the girls in on Basketball Wives yourself. As a matter of fact, your girl is going to order a pair. So once I get them, I'll show them to you. But don't ask someone else to recreate someone else's look. It's just not cool. Just like, It's like asking Gucci to recreate a Ferragamo dress. <laughs> Never. You know that. But anyway, I love you. I will see you back here on Monday because I didn't want to talk about it right away because that's what everyone's talking about. But we got to discuss Miss Casey Anthony in the justice system and just I don't even want to touch it till Monday. You guys know where I'm going with that. I will see you then. Have a good, safe, blessed weekend. I will see you then. Bye-bye.